Okay, well, here I am. It is, um, was it February 19th, I'm thinking? Uh, the nurse took my watch, so I don't can't check. But I'm here at um, Emory Hospital, um, Johns Creek. Um, broke my hip skiing. I uh, didn't really... I was afraid I'd broken it, but thought I could get through the heal, the uh, healing process. But uh, when I got back into town from West Virginia, um, doctor uh, convinced me, doctor and my family convinced me that um, I need to have um, some pins put in to assure a 100% uh, percent recovery. And so I'm here in my room now. I'm all checked in and very quite comfortable and very, very well taken care of. Nice little room and very professional staff. I'm not sure if you can see everything or not in this. I'm having to use my uh, using my front facing camera for uh, for this, so I'm not sure if the video quality is going to be real high. But anyways, yeah, I broke my um, broke my hip, complete break um, up near the the uh, near, near the hip, and uh, but everything is intact, so. Um, doesn't look it looks like just simple pins will be sufficient no kind of hip replacement or anything like that um we're hoping keeping our fingers crossed that um blood flow to the broken piece will uh was not affected by the break because as i said it's a um, it's a complete break but the pieces are everything's still in place and no big separation or gap but uh had a skiing accident showing off caught an edge just got slammed really hard um to the you know, to the ice it happened so rapidly, so fast that I really had no opportunity to mitigate my fall or tuck and roll or anything like that. It was just um, the edge of the skis hooked, and I think they actually hooked on my pole, which got was planted in the, in the wrong spot, and then just uh, that that edge acted as a um, hinge, which I just went bam, just really hard downhill. And um, anyways, they're here to check on me, so I'll be back later. Bye-bye.